welcome to my channel IBM classes today we are going to discuss uh, a catalog table in IBM DB2 which actually holds the session library list so how we can see the library list of a session so for that we will do EDTA library here and we can see that this library has been set here IBM class IBM my class 1 and IBM my class 2 QGPL and QTEM. So let's check. We can see this this file lib list is a DB2 catalog table which actually holds that set particular session uh, library list. So I queried on this file using this statement. This statement select a star from this two dot lib list. So we can see that this is the library list of the current session. So this is the ordinal position here 1 till 10th and this is the schema name actually that is the library name. And then press shift the fate. This is the type. So here we can see that in our library list, we only saw these four libraries QTEM, QGPL, IBM class 1, IBM class 2. So actually, these are the user libraries which we can actually see in our library list, and the product and the system libraries which we can't see, which are preloaded in the library list. So these are the system libraries and this is a product library. So we cannot see this in our uh, library list. So this is the actual file in DB2 which is holding the session library list. Now uh, suppose we change this list by removing this. Okay. Now the library list has been changed. You can see again press enter. Then strsql and again check this. So now we can see that the library really IBM my class 2 is no more here. So this table actually holds the session library list. So from here we can check what are the library libraries set in our library list by using this. Uh, library names or, or we can directly query uh, here that type equals to user f12 f9 then f4 where type is equals to user so these are the library list which actually uh, set in our library list and the other are the app product and system library so this is all about for today's today video uh, thank you and uh, thanks for watching our video